What's up you guys, welcome back to my channel. So continuing on with the series of focusing on isolated, dedicated muscle groups, today we're gonna to focus on chest. Last time we focused on triceps. I'm gonna take you through a series of six different exercises, each of which lasting for 30 seconds. And then, once we're done, we're gonna repeat all over again for a total of eight minutes. Like I always say, you can do anything for eight minutes. So with that in mind, let's get right to it. Before you start, be sure to warm up, stay hydrated throughout, and breathe throughout the entire workout. Let's do it. All right, let's get into position. And we're gonna start nice and simple with the regular push-up for 30 seconds. Down and up. Down and up. Make sure you keep your back nice and straight. Your booty is tucked in. You don't want it drooping, but you also don't want it protruding up. Chest to ground, head forwards. Form over quantity. Five more seconds, and then we're gonna go into diamond push-ups. So for these, you want your hands to be in the shape of a diamond, and you're gonna kind of imagine bring your nose into the center of that diamond and back up. Again, nice and slow. 15 more seconds. These ones are really tricky for me, but they're gonna serve to work our inner chest which is something that I really need to work on. Three, two, one, and switch your stance to a wide grip stance, okay? And down, and up. Now the wider the grip, the wider parts of the chest you're actually going to be focusing on. So for those of you who like to wear sleeveless shirts and show off a little bit of side back, this is your exercise. Three, two, one, and we're gonna break for a minute. Whew. How are we doing? Feel free to stretch out a little bit, take a drink of water. All right, let's get back into position. We're going for a wider grip this time for what I like to call a side lean hover push-up. So you're gonna come down to your right side and you're gonna hover over to your left side. Hover over to your right side, and hover over to your left side. Ten more seconds. Feel free to modify any of these by dropping to your knees. Okay, back to the standard grip. And we're going down for a push up with three pulses. So one, two, and three, and up. One, two, three, and up. Back straight, chest to ground, head forwards. Booty tucked in. Two, one. So now we're gonna go into a raised leg push up. So you're gonna go down with your right leg up in the air and switch, left leg up in the air. Elbows nice and tucked in. <sighs> Last one. <sighs> nice. Whew. Round one complete. We're gonna take a minute and a half break before we do the entire cycle over again. Okay, round two, let's do it, and begin. Elbows nice and tight, tuck to your body, back straight, butt down, shouldn't be drooping like this, nor should it be up like that. Chest to ground, head up. 10 more seconds, nice and slow, nice and controlled. You got this. I have faith in you. Three, two, one. Nice. All right, we're gonna switch it to diamond push-ups. I think these are the hardest. Down and up. Down and up. 15 more seconds. Feel free to drop to your knees if you need to. No worries. Four, 
three, two, and one. Wide grip push-ups, let's go. Ten. Five. Come on, push. Last one. Nice. We'll take a minute break. Whew. You guys feel good? The blood flowing? All right, let's get back into position. We're going for a side lean and hover. It's a wide grip. And we're gonna go down to the right, nice and slow, and shift over to the left. Nice and slow. We're just kind of shifting our body weight. 10 more seconds. Three, two, and one. Back to a more narrow grip, a standard grip. We're gonna go down, we're gonna pulse for three, two, three, and up. And up. And up. And up. And up. Ooh, feel the burn. Nice, last one. And now we're going for raised leg. So right leg up. Left leg up. Last one. I hope you guys are feeling really good after the exercise. I wanna leave you with this. I know that this is probably um, one of the more requested exercises that I show to you guys. Mostly because I, I, I receive a lot of kind compliments about, about my chest. But I wanna tell you this. I, I actually have a condition called pectus excavatum where my chest sort of concaves inwards and you know, when I was younger, back in high school, it was a big source of insecurity for me. I felt like I was just so self-conscious of it. I was teased a little bit. In fact, I remember one time, one girl even, you know, it was a dare to eat cereal out of this hole in my chest. And I sort of used that to really drive me to build up my chest, to sort of compensate for what I felt to be a flaw of mine. Um, so I only say this to hopefully encourage you guys, you know, like thousands and thousands and thousands of push-ups later, I've finally gotten to a place where I'm comfortable and um, I'm proud of my chest and it just makes me really happy that it's something that you guys seem to acknowledge as well. But again, don't judge a book by its cover and hopefully if you guys have any sort of insecurities about anything, not even just a part of your body, hopefully kind of in the same way that I did, you use that to... Um, really channel yourself into something productive um, so that you can become even more confident on the other side. Hopefully this workout serves to do that for somebody out there. I love you guys. If you like this video, if you like this workout, be sure to share it with friends. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Ciao. I'll see you next time. Whew, I'm out of breath. No sé,